everybody. Thanks for checking out the Dude Man Hungry Girl podcast, the DMT pod. We're here with the fellas. You're yep. Patrick Crisper. We have Jacob Flores, Scott Ramos, and Nick Rosales. My favorite Rosales brother. Yeah. Oh, yeah, because you had the other one on, dude. Twice. Oh. We, he lost a bet actually on that. Like Scott doesn't remember having Scott George on. Remember. I don't remember that. Hilarious. He's very unmemorable, well, I guess. Exactly. That and you guy. had him yet before yeah. me. No, but you're here now, man. So uh, welcome, uh, welcome, true, welcome, welcome to the you. pod. Pat, it's not against you. <laughs> no, <laughs> it's not against you. Those guys on that couch. <laughs> yeah, you got beef with Jake? I'm beefing with the homie bros. We don't appreciate it. And not the dude. <laughs> the dude. <laughs> it's the homie bro parts. Well, oh, congratulations, yeah. kid. You made it. Hey, this is thanks. A big yeah, time. this is a big time. This is Hollywood. I'm going to jump in front of a bus after this. <laughs> <laughs> I'll tell you what. You can't drink over there. They will not pick you up. We found out. <laughs> it's true. Oh yeah, we had a bus stop beer. It was just fun. A bus stop at a bus stop and drink a beer. Yeah, and they won't they won't pick you up if you have no. a beer. No, yeah. we uh, we went to a, a restaurant and then we had time to kill. And we're like, let's get a beer. We're just chilled by the bus stop. By the bus stop? We the, no, we sat at the bus stop. The yeah. bus driver like pulled up and like and like gave me that and like kept going. Like Jesus. Yeah, <laughs> I was like, what's that, dude? <laughs> I th- I honestly think bus drivers love when people miss their pickups. Oh yeah, they have to. Oh, they, yeah. they love it. Yeah, and they, they, they tell you, go? they tell you like, don't run after the bus. There's There'll be one another in five one, yeah. but there is. It's yeah. like twenty, a half an hour before you get the next one. But I mean, like, because either way, they're getting paid. It's not like they get. It's not like they're on commission or anything. Yeah, bro, yeah. <laughs> like, oh, we've got to pick up everybody. Yeah. I don't sell transfers. I think yeah. they get paid fat. Oh, for sure. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Do but they? I think so. You know, the highest uh, paid employees in Hawaii are bus drivers. They make more what than makes the, them so important. They, they make more than the police officers. <laughs> they're tourists. It's a big tourist state. I don't know why they're. Yeah, but, that doesn't still. But they do. They are the most, uh, the highest paid yeah, uh, occupation in Hawaii. Uh, but I'm pretty, pretty sure like Via plays pretty well. I mean, I, the public transportation has never been good in San Antonio. It's really tough yeah, to get from. Could you imagine, yeah, good, could you imagine being the one in New York? Yeah. Yeah. Like that has to be crazy. Yeah, for sure. Because I know there's like a bus every like two or three minutes. Yeah, I was talking to to, to Daniel because apparently y'all dropped you dropped off Daniel like at eight in the morning in Austin, and Daniel's just chilling until oh he like, does that all the time on Mondays until like seven o'clock yeah on Mondays until like uh, mothership sign up time or whatever I was like you were here all day dude like just he's like yeah just chilling he just goes to the movies by himself yeah oh. dude, I'm jealous of dude I want to go I wish <laughs> I could do that on a Tuesday just go to the movies at noon yeah man. But okay. I was I was talking because like when I lived in in Seattle, once you get to a certain area downtown, it's free. The bus is free, so it is crowded as it should be all day in downtown area because it's just like homeless people, you know, stinking yeah. up the joint, and well, it's just like it's uh, it's horrible. It's like yeah, because like just from like the blocks downtown, all the downtown area is all free. I don't know. I mean, this was like t- t- ten years ago, fifteen years ago, so I don't know if that's still a thing. I loved it, but at the same time, you got to deal with that. Yeah. That's the price. That's the cost. Yeah, man. So you have to like rub a, like against people like to get out or like oh. they're all like sleeping on the benches and shit. So you're standing and the poles all grimy and shit. Oh. You're like, ah, oh, man, dude. this is horrible. Like, that's dude. crazy. <laughs> Daniel does get good ramp service on the bus though, so that'd be nice. <laughs> that's true. They have <laughs> the hydraulics and everything. I would like that. <laughs> I would like that ramp treatment. It's a lift, not even a ramp. <laughs> that's a good part. Yeah, no, he goes there. Yeah, every Monday. I'm like, all right. <laughs> Yeah, yeah, just let go. They'll do like, like a double. How many movies is he going to? I don't know. I think just one, and then he just but walks around. He, there's no like. I can't put his business out there like that. There's no oh. movie theaters downtown, so like he has to take a bus like to Mueller or whatever, like the closest like Alamo Draft House is. So he has to rather than take an Uber or. Yeah, I think he takes uh, Uber does he does I think he scoop? Ubers to the mall. No, he can't. He scoop. can't. Scoop? He was trying to stand on a still <laughs> one. <laughs> On Sunday, we were downtown there at the, at the Rabbit, and fucking he was there was a scooter parked right up front, and he was like trying to stand on it. Like I have pictures of it, <laughs> of him posing on it, and no, he can't even stand on it right. Yeah, I couldn't. I wouldn't even imagine it moving, at all, with him being on. Imagine, the air. yeah, just yeah, I can't be, see him go five feet, <laughs> not even a little bit. He's Damn. your roommate. You live with that guy. Yeah, how's that? Is it like having a dog? Yeah, dude. That's why. No, I call him my Brian Griffin. <laughs> he's like my dog he's an alcoholic and he cares about politics <laughs> he just talks out of his ass that's fucking Danny Bones dude. this Halloween we're going dressed he's gonna be Brian Griffin I'm gonna be Stewie dude 
<laughs> yeah, get, yeah, that's kind of tough, dude. Oh, dude, it's that's lit. fucking tough. We better win. <laughs> yeah. But no, yeah, Danny George has to be Peter for sure. <laughs> <laughs> that's what he said. That's yeah, he has to. Yeah, he already. <laughs> pretty sure he has that outfit in polo already. <laughs> yeah, doesn't even know that he has the perfect parts. <laughs> <laughs> no, yeah, Liberty Daddy Bus is cool. The only thing I piss, I get pissed at him about is he doesn't get us a handicapped parking spot pass. Because he doesn't drive. Well, no, it doesn't matter. You can get one no matter what. He just doesn't want to do the paperwork for it. Oh, <laughs> yeah. Do the paperwork. I'm not going to do the paperwork. Fuck you. He's then you don't want it that bad. I do. That's what he should, That should be his service to the <laughs> to the troop. <laughs> is that I we look. drive him around. The least he can do is get us good parking. <laughs> look, I'm not he, he arguing. Does, yeah. I drive him over here for shows. I drive him fucking Austin. We drive him his hands work. work fine. <laughs> Daniel does think that he is y'all's meal ticket. Like once he gets on, once oh, yeah. you make it, you're hey, just like. That's why we took him in. <laughs> He's our meal ticket. Dude. Yeah. Kill, that's what we told. We said, you get on Kill Tony, dude. They love handicapped people. You'll kill. You're funny. You're funny in your handicap. You should do at least something with it. And he got fucking the Tobin Center from it. The first time he got on there, that's why he keeps going. That is amazing. He got the Tobin from Yeah, that. that's what I'm saying. So it's just like, bro, Tony loves that kind of weirdo. Man. And he can at least do like 15 minutes, maybe. I got to work on my Kaiser Soze walking yeah, exactly. shit when I go up on Trust Kill me, Tony, dude. Yeah, I always, I always tell him how lucky he is to be disabled, dude, every day. <laughs> <laughs> every day Every day he has, yeah, Every time dude, he has a good so set blessed. I'm like he's lucky fuck Dude it's so easy <laughs> or I help him write jokes I'm like dude If I had your disability I'd already have like an hour <laughs> I was like How are you only doing 15 It's insane to me <laughs> But no daddy's a boy dude. Yeah he, he, he can be my meal ticket Please Yeah I need it George keeps the meal ticket To himself if he gets it. Yeah. Yeah. George is like You said meal Yeah, that's what I mean. yeah. yeah Meal ticket Yeah he ain't sharing that no, but yeah, Danny Bones will be the I think the quickest one to get on. Hell yeah! And it's so funny how y'all <laughs> claim Austin. Y'all live in Kyle. Eighty-eight. I don't claim Austin. I don't claim. We're Austin comic. No, I don't. I never say I'm an Austin comic, dude. I don't say I'm an Austin comic. Yeah. I can't. I can't. Yeah, you're not in Austin. You're not really that funny. No. Uh, <laughs> Hey, dude, you had George on you, and you said I was funnier than him. <laughs> they said that, that. No, you said that. I didn't that. say any of that. You said that. That's why I told I said you're funnier? Pat. You said I'm funnier than George. Uh, I think I was just making a bit. No, see, you're doing a bit right now. Doing a bit, yeah. Just stick it to it. He's doing a bit right now, dude. What's the real Pat and what's the bit? I, I, I can't even tell anymore. I dude. mean, if you, if you know anything about me, <laughs> if you know anything about me, you know I have a huge respect for fat comics. I think they're, they're funnier. Well, that's a little. That's a what? Is bias? Sure. Yeah, that's a little out there. No. Who's who's fat and not funny? What do you, um. <laughs> <laughs> I'm fucking with you, Scott. I love Solid. You. I love you, Scott. I don't know, dude. That's his handicap. You got Danny. What, you, what do you bring to I'm the short. table? I'm short. Short's not a handicap. Dude. Like if y'all I have some great bits about it, though. <laughs> <laughs> I have some good bits about it, dude. That's all that matters. No, I guess. I don't know. I get what you're saying. Fat's a, I don't know, but it could be a crutch. That's why, like, Danny Bones did that show with that Martin Phillips dude this past week. And he said that guy, like, he has cerebral palsy, too. He said he didn't do one disabled joke. No shit. Yeah, Danny Bones was like, dude, I respect him because he didn't do one disabled joke. And I was like, that's wild. That's, I mean, yeah, for a disabled guy, that's crazy. Yeah. Like, that's cool. Like, it's not that he's just a fat comic. You, you don't want to be, I mean... You know, you don't want to just be known as a fat comic. I mean, but you got to throw it in there. You got to like, Oh, you know, yeah, of course. That's they know. Yeah, that's <laughs> the, the audience yeah, knows, dude. I can't say certain words. But I tell Daniel to say certain <laughs> words that he can say. And I'm like, dude, say it. You're, you can say it. <laughs> you know the word I'm talking about. <laughs> yeah. Oh. I don't know if we can say it. You got, it wasn't part of the two that you said we couldn't say. I think uh, it's I just, I just rather yeah. you not. Yeah, about, that's, what, that's yeah. why I didn't. Just reread. But, Okay, yes, then yes, that. <laughs> you got I say seconds. you got to use it, dude. That's your superpower. Use it. Superpower. That's your superpower, dude. You're being fat, fine. Tell fat jokes, I guess. But You can tell fat jokes, too. Don't act like you're not fat. I'm not, I don't think you're I'm just not as fat, fat as your brother. I don't think I'm fat enough to tell fat jokes. No, you can do fat uh, jokes, for sure. Can I? Oh, yeah. Well, I do my Mike Wazowski joke, and that's kind of a fat joke because I'm just a round thing. Yeah. So but that's, that's, calling me I thought fat. you were calling the other person. No, I called Mike him Sully. So the chick is Sully and I'm Mike Wazowski. Yeah. And that's like a fat joke. Or I say, uh, I have one where I talk about my tits. <laughs> so, yeah, your I don't, your I don't, short I'm, tits or your fat tits? My fat tits. My All short, right, yeah. see? Well, it's, they might be more of tits because I'm short. If I was stretched out more, I probably wouldn't have tits. <laughs> Yeah, there's a correlation, dude. Yeah, these it's are a my butterfly short, effect. Dude. These are my short tits. Yeah, these are my short tits. But if I was big, I probably wouldn't have tits. 
Yeah. <laughs> These guys are wasting their heights over here. We'll stretch you out. That's what makes me mad, too. People that waste their heights. Drake, you said he'll stretch you out. You think I'd be sitting on this couch right now if I was his fucking height? Tam Vera just texted me. That's my time? Uh, no, it's my time. I think you <laughs> Something about to go off? <laughs> yeah, for real. The hot pockets done or something? <laughs> It's so funny to think that like you and George were the same size at one point. No. No? No. Dude, when I was a little kid, I was fucking you're like, a, you were a little monkey. I was a little spider monkey, bro. You're a little spider monkey? Big head, little ass skinny body. That's so funny. So you got into comedy, George. And like who got into comedy first and like George. what like you're just okay. So yeah, you're like George got in first and then fat asshole. Yeah. Yeah, it's his fault. <laughs> All this. Uh, yeah, he did it. He was doing it, but he would only go to L O L Mike. He only did like a couple shows, but he got booked on some showcase he did at the Tobin like twice just from doing that uh, like a couple times. Oh, so you're the only one that hasn't done the Tobin, dog? Yeah, dude, that's what I tell him. Yeah. That's what he got over me, dude. Hey, I'm not that good yet. <laughs> yeah. I'm not that good yet. I'll get there. I promise you, Pat. Do you miss San Antonio? Yeah. Uh, it's yeah. right down the street. Yeah, really no, yeah, is. no, no, yeah. I don't miss, I miss the, like the comedy sometimes. Like the mics, because the mics over here sometimes, but like well, at least LOL. LOL is what I miss. That mic is just like, fuck, I wish I had anything close to that mic yeah. in Austin. And there's there's like, no scene in Kyle, right? You have, you have to go to Austin? They actually have a couple. Or they have mics there. They have a, they have a mic. Oh, no, they have, do a couple shows at a bar out there. But I don't know the guy that runs them. Like, it's some guy that I don't even think he's a comic. He's just some old white dude that puts on old white people. Hit him up. Yeah. I don't know his name. <laughs> but I will. You gotta be aggressive, man. You gotta put. No, yeah, that's there. what we've been getting told in Austin. Like, you gotta ask for shit. You can't just. You gotta be around. annoying with it, cause like yeah, there's so many comics. Be, there's so many comics. comics. Like you're not like on anybody's like list. Like, oh, I need to get them. They're like, yeah, oh, no, they, for sure. They just hit me up, so I'll put them on a show, or whatever. Yeah. Uh, but for yeah, sure. man, and and like it's so oversaturated with like uh, the Austin scene. Oh yeah, it's crazy. crazy. But at the, at the same time, like they do have like good rooms, and then they have the celebrity pop-ins and stuff. Or, yeah, it's cool, man. It's like warranted. Yeah, man. It is cool. It's getting, it's getting like it's pretty dope. Like shit that's going on. How often are y'all going up? Like four, three or four times. Hell yeah! If we could, the rabbit helps out a lot too. We fucking bark for that. Uh, so we get up on there. Uh, but that room is fucking cool, man. That room is like, I love that room. Yeah. That room is just fucking, you get 15 people in there, that shit still sounds loud as fuck. Oh, for real? Yeah. Oh, like, that's dope, dude. Because I think what, it's like a 40 seat it's max. like 50, I think, maybe. 50 capacity? Yeah. Uh, which I can imagine, 50 people oh, in that yeah, little room. Dude. We did the show with the, that Mac McCusker did there once. Oh, you were on that one? Yeah, we did one of the, sh- the showcases he was on. Oh, that's cool. And yeah, dude, it was, and that, shit, that show got packed. And yeah, it was fucking sold out. It was fucking dope, man. That was like... Cause that's the thing, man. If you put like a like a celebrity, and I just call him celebrity. I know that he's a comedian, but like he's a no celebrity big name, comedian. yeah, for sure. Like people, people go and pack out these shows, hoping that they'll see somebody that they see on their favorite podcast or their favorite, yeah, you know, sure. whatever. If, if Shane Gillis pops in, you know, it yeah, could that, happen now. That's yeah. why when we bark, we just tell them whatever race they are, a comic from them that's gonna be there. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. We're like, hey, Kevin Hart, Kevin Hart's not going to be there tonight. They're black. But see, you can't go Kevin people, Hart because hey, no, Kevin know, Hart's not going to be there. We do it if they're really not interested. Like, if they already walked by without grabbing a flyer, yeah. we're like, Kevin Hart, Kevin Hart's going to be there. Like, you just fucking yeah. like, saving Indian people. Rumor has yeah. it, Kevin Hart is in town. Yeah, yeah. we're like, or yeah, white dudes were just like, Shane Gillis, dude, Shane Gillis is going to be there. And it's possible. I think it's possible. Yeah. But. It's going to like Russell Peters. Yeah, we've done that for Indian people, too. That's or we just say Tamir Aurora, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. He's known now. Now that he's uh, killing it on Kill Tony. Yeah, fuck yeah, dude. I love it. I got you. Are you trying to get you? Did you sign up for Kill Tony? Yeah, I was there yesterday, but I didn't get pulled. I don't know what minute I would do. That's why I always have see. To and go. Daniel and I were talking about it. He's like, "What minute are you gonna do?" I was like, "I'm, I'm gonna wait till I get called, and then I'm gonna get in the zone." But I should have done it because when I did Kill Tony like six years ago, I manifested that shit. I, I was like, "I'm did gonna you be." Kill Tony yeah, like oh, when they were in nice. and uh, uh, LOL. He had a drum off. I had a drum off, man. Whoa. Yeah, dude. Oh uh, but this was like before, <laughs> it, this was before they blew up. They were like maybe getting 5,000 views an episode. Now they get like a million views in a week. Oh, yeah. Uh, you know, so it was 1.6 in one. 1.6 1. in one day? Yeah. Yeah, dude. Like that's, that's crazy stuff. So 
But when I got pulled, I was like, I'm going to get pulled. I'm going to be the last one. When he goes like, we, we got time for one more comic. Nice. I was like, dude, that's going to be me. I'm going to go. And then sure enough, they got pulled. And now when I go up, I'm just like, eh, it will happen, whatever, whatever. Yeah. <laughs> now you're trying to play it cool. I try to play it cool. Try to play it cool, but no, that's terrifying. Because I don't want to, like, not only is it disappointing to, like, drive out there, not get on the mothership mic, and then not get called for Kill Tony. Like, I don't want to build up. I don't want to be there two hours all building it up, like, oh, it's going to happen. It's going to happen. It's going to happen. That's true. That makes sense. So I'm just like, if it happens, it happens. If not, whatever, you know. Yeah, for Yo, sure. Yo, would you lie? Like, do you put that on, like, as seen on Kill Tony? Nah. I wouldn't. I wouldn't. I mean, I would, I'm just hoping that I'm I will seeing. do well enough for it to make but you an did impact. It. But I wouldn't do that. Like kill Tony. Like people have killed Tony shows or whatever. Like I'm not gonna use it That's as a credit. Tell I don't, them, Daniel. <laughs> I don't think I would use it as a credit. <laughs> but I would. I would hope that it could make a boost. It would give me a boost. Like, I, I mean, I would use that now as seen on Kill Tony. I don't know, man. And maybe you're just. I don't remember that person. Maybe a. Yeah, I skipped I mean, that episode. I didn't know what happened. No offense. To I don't. Know. I don't. I don't. I don't do credits. Like when, like, any time I do shows, like people ask me, like, "Oh, what do you want to bring up?" I was like, oh, "Just bring me up," you know. And uh, it it did uh, piss me off. One of the last shows I did, uh, the host has like, "Oh, what do you want to bring up?" I was like, "Just, oh, just bring me up." And then uh, another comic is like, "He hasn't done shit." Whoa. And I was like, "God damn." That's All right, man. <laughs> yeah, cool. Whatever, dude. Uh, <laughs> thanks, dog. Damn. <laughs> Uh, and then he goes up with all his credits. Like he's, he's done. who was it? Just the fucking. Idiot. I'll tell you. Oh, uh, God damn, dude. That's funny. We were talking about him earlier too. Yeah. Times. But I was like, <laughs> all right. Well, I can go like one. You know, uh, Cedric the comedian's joke contest, comedy joke contest, or whatever. But I'm not gonna. Yeah, for real, right? You That's know. true. Yeah, I hate people yeah. Like, winning little competitions here and there and using it as fucking. Credit. I mean, it is in my bio, but I'm not gonna have people like. I would use it as a credit for a flyer. Nah, it's in my bio, but it's not on my. I'm not gonna have people bring me up as that because, like, I don't think the honest gives a fuck. No, I mean just for flyers. Oh, At yeah. least that's it. Not yeah. If I'm ever in the newspaper, maybe. <laughs> like when I brought up uh, Alex Ramondo, his credit was. Founder and president of Number One Tequila. Give it up for Alex Ramon. Is like, that not, true? Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Is that oh, all wait, they sold? Did uh, he name it Number One Tequila? Number One. Oh, I was going to say. I thought it was in Ron White. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. But he, he's partners. the founder and the president. But he didn't go like, oh, you see me on the original Kings of Latin Comedy. Or but before, Latin that, Latin comedy. Bunch of shit but before that, yeah. should, before the tequila shit, how do you they were bringing them up? Oh, probably like, you know, like... Uh, Original. Latin Kings of Comedy yeah. and all that stuff. But what, what I'm saying now, like his credit is he's pushing the tequila thing. Yeah. Because I think the tequila, the tequila is what's like making him money. I mean, that, that guy's <laughs> in, great, a, dude. That guy's yeah. in a tour bus. Oh, he's living the high life? Yeah, it was the high life, dude. For real? It was cool, dude. Yeah, talk about That's it. cool. What the fuck? No, nah, like, well, like he, oh, yeah, you dig it on the bitch. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Because he's like, uh, I always drink with the people. And he couldn't drink with the, the feature because the feature was like 17 years old. So he's like, oh yeah, that kid's cool. Yeah, yeah, he was on Kill Tony, and yeah, that, yeah. he asked me to say his credit. He was like, yeah, I'm a favorite of Kill Tony. He did the arena show and yes, <laughs> on yeah, Kill yeah, Tony. Yeah. I was like, all right, man, I'll say whatever you want me to yeah. say, dude. Uh, but yeah, went on the tour bus, and uh, it was pretty good. Like it was all like, uh, like shelled out. So like, there's like a he has a fireplace and a fucking Damn. couch. And then a little bit in the back. He rides by himself. Like, it's not like a tour bus where they have, like, bunks and stuff. Yeah. It's just a one master bedroom, kitchen, and then the lounge area, and then the driver. And uh, he's like, yeah, I, I don't make it. I, I ask if the comics want to drink before the show. I always drink before the show with the comics. So if you want it. So me and Bobby are there like, yeah. That's dope. Fuck yeah. It was cool. It was good shows, man. I just yeah. think, like. I think he would have done better because he did Friday 10 p.m., Saturday 10 p.m. I think he would have done better if it was like 8 yeah. or 7. Oh, it was only one show? A little bit over, older crowd. Older crowd, yeah. Well, yeah, it was one show Friday, one show Saturday. Oh. But like yeah, they, were, late. they were late night for that crowd because uh, they were a little bit older older crowd, you know, whatever. Um, but yeah, the bar was selling his tequila. Oh, damn. Uh, offering like the tequila drinks, yeah. That's it's actually nice. pretty good. That's it, yeah. yeah. Yeah, and that guy's making good money, dude. You get to go do comedy, sell some tequila. Yeah, man. <laughs> Hell yeah. 
That's a life right there. What are we doing, man? But that's that, <laughs> but that's his tour bus doesn't say Alex Ramundo. It says number one tequila. That's a tax write off, baby. Yeah, he's trying to sell the shit. Yeah, it is a tax write off. It's yeah. a promotion. It's traveling promotions. You know, genius. Nice. Yeah. I got some. Oh, uh, I gotta he's like yeah, just I gotta this guy. shows <laughs> to be to have something to do. Yeah. I guess. Yeah. That's wild. And he gets to sell it on the road. His yeah. tequila and shit, too. Yeah, man. This guy's a genius. And he's just up there <laughs> drinking. He's yeah. like, well, if, if y'all don't like a joke, I'm going to drink. If y'all like a joke, I'm going to drink. You know what? I'm just going to drink. And it's every, every like, five minutes, he's drinking straight from the bottle. Jeez. Rip a solo tequila. I was like, damn, dude, I wish I could do that. <laughs> yeah, you can, dude. Start doing it. You think that's just every show? Oh, yeah, for sure. Drinks at the same point. Wow. Oh, you mean? The oh, same I don't know if he drinks cues? at the same he has point. Drinking cues? Yeah. No, nah, I don't think he's like. I don't think it was uh, like uh, planned. I think he just wanted to drink. <laughs> that would be hilarious if it was. <laughs> he planned. was just yeah. really thirsty. He was really thirsty. Sabasque. And that's all he was drinking was the shit. <laughs> just tequila, just straight tequila. Sabasque. Yeah. All right, so Shot. before, during, after, how many, how many shots? Him or what? Yeah. Uh, I would assume like. A couple of shots, and then he takes a bottle on stage and drinks straight from the bottle. So I think oh. at least ten swigs a shot. How, God, how old is the guy? Uh, Fifty nine. Nice. Ten sw- shit. At least ten swigs. Yeah. Pretty cool. And he wasn't. Was he fucked up at the end? Nah, not at all. Whoa. Uh, you you he, think he had water in there? He does this on a daily. <laughs> he does this on a daily. It's like we're, smoke, we're smoking weed. Like, if y'all smoke one hit, y'all aren't going to do nothing. But if I do it, I'm just like, uh, makes sense. you know? Yeah. Because yeah. y'all are used to it. You know? Y'all just, y'all. Yeah, but that's a wild, that's a wild amount of shots. Not if you're used to it. A night? Not that can't be health. Like, that's that's like more or less my route that I'm saying. That's your low T talking, dude. Yeah, that's true. And it's, you think you could do it? You ain't a real drinker, brother. That's all. <laughs> if you ain't a real drinker, you just say it. that, Scott. <laughs> Ten shots a night. Minimum, and I I did I did because uh, he wanted to party Friday. I was like, Nah, man, I I gotta drive. I can't party, but I will party tomorrow. I'll party tomorrow with you because he's like, You want to smoke? I was like, I don't. I'll smoke with you, bro. But like, it's like you want to smoke and drink and hit a bowl real quick. I was like, Tomorrow, tomorrow, <laughs> and then uh, so I took a lift there with plans to like That's drink. That's hilarious. Yeah. Started drinking after I did my set. I started drinking. I was ordering the bar. Give me another. Number one. Number one. Give me, yeah. give me another yeah. one, number one. Two number ones. Yeah, give me another more, one more number one. <laughs> yeah. And so I had three. So by the time, and then, well, Saturday he went long. He was supposed to end at like 11.30. He didn't get up to like close to midnight. Oh, shit. And so I was like, dang, man, I don't think we're going to party. <laughs> 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 and uh, so like uh, he finished the show. He's selling, selling T-shirts, taking pictures, all this stuff. And then uh, my wife texted me that she just got off work. And I was like. All right, come pick me up then. I guess. <laughs> oh, so you didn't party? So well, because you... like at Walsham, it's hard to get a lift late later. Like at past yeah. midnight, people don't want to drive over there. It's hard to get a lift, you yeah, know. That makes sense. So I was like, I don't want to take a chance of like getting stuck out here or like having to pay like thirty bucks to get a ride home or something. That's where my grandma lives, dude. Uh, right. Yeah, I work on the other side. I'm on I'm on the other side of Eisenhower. Yeah, my, my yeah. grandma too. And. Uh, so by the time he was done, my wife was already there. I was like, my ride's here. I got to go. <laughs> oh, yeah, my wife, yeah. My wife's here to pick me up. Yeah. Damn, that sucks, dude. You should really get turned up with him. Because I was going to. I was like, man, I'm going to smoke with Alex Ramundo. I'm going to drink his tequila. Yeah, fuck yeah. Uh, you want to make me part tequila older? with the guy that made the tequila? Yeah, dude. Yeah. I want to try to get some more gigs because he's doing some more like road shows. He's doing like uh, Houston this weekend, McAllen, Del Rio. Oh, yeah. You got to be a good that hang. That could have ran, dude. Bro. Right? Yeah. yeah. Good hang. I, never, I never get the opportunity to be a good hang because I don't drink and drive. Uh, I Wait, know. It's yeah. like, Would you? It's Texas. This I just like, I'm, I'm 40. I can't get a D, uh, DWI now. Like you get a DWI in your twenties, yeah, I guess. Your 30s. I'm I'm if you get it in your forties, yeah. what the? Get your shit. Together. Yeah, that makes sense. Now, if I got right. a DWI in my forties, right, I had to quit comedy. You're old. You're right. <laughs> <laughs> you're right. My fault. Forty, not nice. a, not fifty. Yeah, you're yeah, old. Yeah, like yeah, you're some 40, people. Yeah, forty is wild. <laughs> <laughs> All right. Did it ever cross your mind? Y'all just leave the car here and take a lift home. No, I, I don't like no, you're not because then I had to figure out how I'm going to get my car back, and then and then I'm not. I not, I'm not leaving my car there. No, anywhere? Not not anywhere. Yeah, LOL? There. 
Uh, yeah, I'll leave my car at LOL. Like in the garage? Uh, yeah. <laughs> yeah. All right. So what do you uh, think, Pat? You now, to live in that area. Now I get it. Live in that area. They don't want to leave your car around somewhere. Park, <laughs> Park North has security. They have driving security that drives Girl. around. That's true. You don't think Bobby has good security? You tell me, Bobby. You guys don't have good security? <laughs> <laughs> Oh, shit. I'm <laughs> location, location, yeah, location. Yeah, for sure. I'm with you, bro. I'm, trust me, I know that neighborhood. <laughs> yeah. But no, nah, like nothing makes me feel like, especially like if I, when I get home, by the time I get home, if I'm sober up, I'm like, why the fuck did I leave my car over there? You know what I mean? Oh, like, I could have, I could have made it. Because then it's a hassle the next day. Like you said, it's a whole thing. It's a whole hassle, dude. I'm with you. On it's that. a whole that thing. Sense. That's why I'd rather just drink a drive. Um, <laughs> like if that's why, I, like. When I lived in Austin, like I took the bus everywhere. I didn't. I never drove, and this was before Lyft, so it was a fucking hard thing to do. And then I would take a cab, an actual Damn. taxi cab back. Right. Showing uh, your age a little again. Yeah, dude. I mean, that's just <laughs> yeah. what it was. Two thousand, two thousand five. There wasn't oh, Lyft or Uber or nothing like that. So I would. I'm I would, still in high school. I would bus. I would bus downtown, get mad fucked up, and then I was like, because I lived off Old Torf. Which oh, yeah. is which isn't far, but it's far. It's outside. So I was like, I could just walk it, and so I'm walking, and then by the time I get to that IHOP that's right there off of 35, I'm just like, I'm gonna have to call a cab, dude. <laughs> <laughs> that's insane. <laughs> Twenty man. bucks, but uh, shit. And in Seattle, all I did was walk, so I like, I was drinking everywhere all, all the time. Never drove in Seattle. That's cool. I'd like to live in a city where I don't have to drive. Yeah, dude. Like if I lived in New York, I would I would OD for sure, dude. You're capable that of drinking every sure. day. Yeah, if I don't like, I, the only reason I don't is because I gotta drive. Wow, like that. No, I mean like, you're, but if you did like a like a quick five to seven bit at the house, just chilling. Yeah, you're drinking every day. No, no, no. Like I'm when I drink, I go out. I don't drink at home. He's a social drinker. All right, so the the bar that's downstairs. Yeah. You know the bar that. Uh, no, I mean like, I would drink because. I was playing shows, or yeah. I was like going to rehearsal, or I was like going to a show. I'm not. I don't go to. I go to a bar maybe once a week. Now. Yeah. But when I go out, if I go to a show, I'm drinking. If I'm playing a show, I'm drinking. If I'm at rehearsal, I'm drinking. But I, it's not like, oh, I got the day off. No, well, that's not true. I would have the day off to go to a bar and drink. This but guy. like. Yeah, I guess it was every day. I don't know, man. That's right. But I wasn't driving, so that's the whole thing. Yeah, you can be a piece of shit if you're not driving. <laughs> no, I, 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 <laughs> exactly. <laughs> no, I'm for real. You can do whatever you want. And I, I knew, I knew bar, driving. yeah, I knew bartenders. So I would get hooked up. So which makes it worse. It's always good to have like bartender friends, but it's a bad idea to have bartender mm. friends. Yeah. Because like then you're just drinking and you're only paying for one out of every four drinks. Mm -hmm. You're just like, oh, and they I have shit. cocaine. <laughs> yeah, <I'm> cocaine. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. That's usually how the game works. Yeah, that's how it I is. actually never did cocaine in Seattle. I tried, but I couldn't do it. Well, what I couldn't find it. Yeah. I couldn't find oh, it. Oh, like, yeah, what does that mean? Yeah. I just couldn't find it. It's more of a heroin city. Yeah. Dude, how are you such a drinker and you couldn't find cocaine? That's wild. No, well, I just didn't I didn't run in the same circles. And um, the band that I was in, they were like against it. It's because there was one oh. time where I was I almost had it. Band. Sounds like a pretty hardcore band. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> Well, I mean, no, he's got the real legit hard work, guys. <laughs> he's saying no to drugs. Yeah. You got you to you understand, like, when we, were, <laughs> when we were doing it, it was considered a business. It's like comedy. It's like, yeah, that's true. Yeah, you it's supposed to be considered a business for, for some of us. Dude, it's uh, a business, dude. Some more than others in this room. But, uh, <laughs> oh. <laughs> I don't know, dude. I, th I think you cocaine was you? necessary. <laughs> <laughs> But it's bad for business, and I get that. Like I wouldn't no, do it. Yeah, no, I wouldn't yeah. do it now. Like the whole reason why I'm like I'm so busy in comedy is because I quit doing cocaine. Because like that makes sense. I've never done cocaine in my life. I'm just fucking around. <laughs> you never done it. Oh, no. pussy. Shut the fuck yeah, up. Yeah, I'm, I'm just fucking around. I've never done. I would never you do cocaine. Do. That's terrifying. That is totally terrifying get it. to me. Dude. But yeah, like say I'm if I much had one night of partying, I'd be down for like three days, like just recovering and like sitting in a dark room thinking everybody hates me. I'm just like. <laughs> There's no way I could go out in public like this, you Damn. know. So I had to quit. It was it's for the No, that makes sense, yeah. For the better. That's good, yeah. And I don't miss it. I don't miss it. Um, that much. That much. <laughs> yeah, I was like, uh, yeah, you don't have to lie, dude. It's okay. It's I got good. some funny uh, internet questions. Whoa. Internet questions. Yeah. Oh, oh, uh, so I did I did put a question out there. I said we're gonna do a pod and I was trying to do this, like, oh, we're gonna do a pod today. What should we talk about? Blah blah blah. Uh Facebook took it down because apparently I was like 
soliciting uh, personal information from people, which whatever. Yeah, let's talk about their social security number. <laughs> yeah, but the one question I got from Tiger Reeves, uh, uh, the only Tiger I fuck with. Uh, Get on. <laughs> <laughs> who who would you bring back from the dead to roast? Who would you want to bring back from the dead and roast them? Anybody? Anybody. Anybody? Well, I'm thinking like comedian. Anybody, yeah. Anybody? Hitler? Yeah, that, I was <laughs> yeah, that's kind of... <laughs> that's pretty, yeah. That's you really want to bring Hitler back just to like... <laughs> get <laughs> off! You're short, yeah, stupid. He needs to get, <laughs> he needs to get his comeuppance, dude. dude. <laughs> what, yo, if he's never been talked to yeah. like that... Hey, your yeah. art stinks, yeah. bro. Yeah. <laughs> you can't failure. paint worth a shit, dog. <laughs> yeah. Light numbers, dude. Light numbers. Yeah. <laughs> yeah, six mil. Come on, dude. Yeah. What kind of paper did you Get use? A turd? Yeah. Get your weight up. To uh, me, 10. <laughs> 10 mil, dude. <laughs> 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 don't just say it, Hitler. Uh, no, I don't know. That's a good one. Hitler's kind of the... The, the go-to. The go-to. Um, Jesus. Yeah. Hitler, Jesus, John Lennon. Elvis, I think, would be a funny roast. <laughs> Elvis would be a funny roast. I, think Elvis would be a funny Elvis roast. I saw the Elvis yeah. movie and really thought less of him after that. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> I didn't really think, yeah, I wasn't really held up to that much of a high regard anyway, but that movie, I was like, oh, what was wrong I with I love that movie. It was a good movie. No, I'm not saying it was bad. Yeah. I was just like, come on. It made, it, it made him seem that he had a very unhappy life. Like, all that success and stuff, all that, like, keeping busy yeah. and not making any money. Like that's I didn't realize how uh, broke he was. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Uh, like he really his contract Tom Hanks took everything. Yeah, his contract really fucked him. But he lives like the big life, like oh, uh, penthouse in Vegas, Cold a Cold. show every night, all this stuff. But nah, man, imagine that. Imagine that, like from the perspective's uh, point of view, spectator's point of view, mm -hmm. they see. Billboards, your name in lights, billboards, they know you live in a penthouse, they know you have a show every day, but they have no idea that you're like financially fucked for all this shit. Yeah. Biggest name, like people still talk about him today as if he was like still relevant, but like broke as fuck. Yeah, that sucks. Addicted dude. to pills, That's you know. That's just how music was back then, dude. Yeah. Just Marrying like minors. Uh, it was kind of a bad Yeah, look. that was, yeah. That's me, rock and roll. <laughs> Not my rock and roll. Yeah, <laughs> oh, yeah you guys are going to do cocaine, dude. Yeah. <laughs> we got no cocaine. money and no bitches, but we love the music we played. Yeah. <laughs> but we're passionate. <laughs> but we, yeah. yeah. And angry. We're artists, yeah. bro. <laughs> we're passionate and angry. Uh, <laughs> yeah, dude. Would you that. rather be Elvis or Michael Jackson? Whoa. See, Michael, Michael wasn't Jackson. broke. Michael, Michael wasn't Jackson broke. Was Michael was not so broke. I love, well, I don't know. Hey, no, I love that, that. No, I love that video. Have you seen that video when he went to like that antique store and he's like giving an interview? Oh, yeah, yeah, And he's yeah, just yeah, like, yeah. yeah, I want that. I want that. Give me two of those. I want That's that. Right. And it's just like fucking million dollar things. And he's just like, yeah, let me get one of those. And he's just like pointing out just fucking weird like sculptures and shit. Do you have this one in purple? Yeah, and he's just buying everything. Just like, yeah, let me get two of those. And they're just going to like, okay, we'll that. ship them to you, sir. Like, come on. I dude, thought that's they said money. like never going to close this shit. It closed now. Yeah. Like his estate did. ran out of money now. Now the magic's lying. <laughs> Fucking no, dead. I, I figured more money would have came in. Well, I mean, I, I mean, the dude, the dude made financially smart decisions. He he bought all the Beatles' fucking masters. Yeah. And then he sold them to com uh, for commercials. For Pepsi or some shit, right? All this stuff, yeah. Genius. So, I mean, that that's money. Genius. Genius. Oh, yeah. That's money. So, I mean, like, I don't think financially, I mean, but other things considered, well, I would yeah. not want to be Michael Jackson. Yeah. <laughs> that, yeah, no. You know, there's a, there's but, a, a latter half. But Elvis yeah, also. But also Elvis. Yeah, you got to pay. Hey, but he did his at the beginning. Yeah, but at least Elvis put a ring on it, Dean. You know. Yeah. <laughs> he made it legitimate. It was yeah. consensual. Bro, there's a fucking plane named after her. Is it? But you have a theme park. Is it Lisa home. Marie? That's his daughter. Oh, then never mind. No. <laughs> He was into that too. <laughs> <laughs> oh, Jesus, you got to be a theme yeah, park you in your home. Elvis? Like you know, if you're Michael Jackson, you're you're walking around with some cash. Yeah, in your but pocket. do I want a theme park when I'm that old? <laughs> Dude, like, should I want a theme worry? park? You still like, wouldn't be able to. If ride I'm a the rich rides. thirty year old guy, my dream isn't to have a theme park in my backyard. Dude, imagine how they how they did <laughs> the solid. how they did the Tom Brady roast. 
What if they did like they brought Michael Jackson back? That same all panel, yeah, and not yeah, the football yeah. players, but all the same panel roasting oh. Michael Jackson, dude. Imagine how hard that uh, that would have been. That would have been yeah. And I know they do Brutal. like they do. Uh, that would be roast. amazing. They do like roast of the dead people. Yeah, or the something. history roast. The history roast. Yeah. Oh, the history but, roast. But like, yeah. it's him. It's like really him. Knowing all that we know about him, dude, imagine they what gotta do that like, to R. Kelly. Get him out of prison and let them roast him. But see that that's uh, the, the whole thing of like. Well, it's the only way we can get it for real. Well, because like real him, <laughs> <laughs> Michael Jackson would be like a hologram now. No, I mean you whatever. Oh, we're shit. talking. Like, I forgot the question. That was a thing. I thought we're talking like realistically. Of, like, no, you bring them back, but they have to go back after they're done. Oh. Like it's not like okay, so they're gonna no be around for an hour and a half. <laughs> yeah, no repercussions. Burn them. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> We kill them all over again. Oh, but yeah. you get to hear them make the final word at the speech at the end. They get oh, the who would you who would Hitler. Hitler, oh. Hitler was great at speeches. Oh. You know what I mean? Michael Jackson is up there like, yeah, I did it. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I did it. What are you going to do about it? Yeah. <laughs> yeah. I mean, he fucking leaves like Terminator. Like, <laughs> <laughs> like, <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Come Halloween, he Thriller's still going to be on. He moonwalks out. And I'll do it again. And you're still going to listen to my music. Yeah, which is true. the Thriller dance while he's walking away <laughs> and my plane don't leave for 14 hours <laughs> you should have never brought me back that's fucking great <laughs> that's what I'm saying man you should like peace man <laughs> oh dude yeah <laughs> Or he escapes and never shows up to the roast. Oh, <laughs> like, well, yeah, where'd he go? Just yeah. a man on the run. Just a man on the run, uh, dude. Who would uh, be that guest panel? You know Macaulay Culkin's going to say some words. Uh, <laughs> There's a monkey that's going to go and talk shit. Yeah, they're going to have a translator. <laughs> He's got his fucking pet monkey. Uh, oh, um, dude. That would be a good roast. I would like to watch that. That would be fun. Speaking of monkeys. Um, oh, what is the fiercest animal you think you could oh, take in a fight? Oh, I'm about to think. Yes. I thought we couldn't say that kind of stuff right? over here. Yeah, yeah, yeah. <laughs> Thank I thought you. I was going somewhere else, huh? Dog. Yeah. <laughs> you never know. Warn somebody. <laughs> I want to get better at transition there, Jimmy. Oh, what man. are y'all thinking, guys? <laughs> Good. What are, cats. What is the fiercest animal you think you could take in a fight? Fiercest animal, like I'm talking, like ostrich. I think I could choke out a mountain lion. What? You could choke out? No. A mountain lion. You would asked fuck me. You up, he didn't dude. ask you. <laughs> 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 you asked me what I thought. Not what you thought, dude. Give me my opinion. <laughs> I could choke out lion. a mountain lion, to my knowledge. Are you fast? Are you? Are you? Are you spry? Do you get... I'm gonna wait for you. <laughs> Wait till it goes by, like kind of like do the side trick with the leg. Get them fucking knock his head. You know, RKO it, dude. What the fuck? What's your plan? I've watched mountain enough wrestling. I've watched enough Rey Mysterio to fucking Hurricane Rana a mountain lion, dude. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, but they're in on it, too. Yeah, I know. It's Paul's alone. The mountain alone. lion's not like, no, I read the script. Dude, it's I Paul's know. alone would fuck up your jugular for That's sure. not how I would die. I doesn't want die? me to die by mountain lion. <laughs> you won't allow it. You won't yeah, allow it. yeah, God would allow it, dude. It's not even, it's above me. Choke out a mountain lion. <laughs> this is at my pay grade. Yeah, it's above my pay grade. Uh, I just dude, work here. I, I just know. work here. Yeah, I think a mountain lion. Would you like guillotine style, like choke it, or would you yeah, like choke it with your hands? Or I'd have to. It. Yeah. <laughs> That's how you do yeah. it. <laughs> Jakey. Show him how easy you can get out of that. Show him. <laughs> Come on, dog. You know, I'll do it. I'll choke you out right now, Jake. <laughs> <laughs> come on, cat. Yeah, come on. Yeah, come on. Yeah. Fierce little cat. <laughs> Dog, you won't. Dude, you're a cat. <laughs> <laughs> and you got to think, this is with adrenaline running here. This is like when I'm, it's life or death. He's going to take it easy on you. No, no, no. I'm saying it said. won't be the same. Do I heard a, what he said. Do animals have adrenaline rushes? I'm I'm sure. sure. So yeah, he'll he'll fight back. He'll fucking like, be thrashing. Hey, dude. I don't think I don't think it's gonna be like. Shh. No, <laughs> no, no, no. That's why I'm gonna choke it, but I'm gonna make sure I stay away from it. It's trying to bite. <laughs> See, so you're both just thrashing around yeah. and shit. Dude. You give up? You give up? <laughs> I hear it stop breathing, dude. And that's when I let go. Only then will I let go. <laughs> uh, no, for real. I think I, I think I take a mountain lion. I saw a video of him. I mean, that's, that's a wild statement. A baby mountain lion. Okay, probably. well, go ahead. Give me your answers, please. 
I don't know, animal. man. What's have the, some, I mean, have some self fucking belief, guys. You have logic in that, but I'm just thinking like, ah, I, I mean, you still gotta catch it. It's gonna come to me, dude. And, he's just, you're just gonna and catch if it comes it. to me, it better not miss. That's yeah. all I'm saying. <laughs> <laughs> like, do what do you, you got, Jake? Who do you think? Do you think Tough you guy? could like fuck up a horse? Not a horse. A horse kick. Is, no, I fuck you up. As long as I stay in front of it. But how would you kill a horse with your bare hands? You can't dick. just jab it. I'd probably just break its dick. Twist the dick, right? That's one of the go-tos. Yeah, that's so not a go-to. That's the closest thing to my size that it's on the body. Damn. Oh, dude. I would yeah. like to do a power slap match against a horse. <laughs> 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 yeah, how do you kill a horse without a gun? <laughs> yeah, that's true, man. Google that. <laughs> Google <laughs> that. Cool yes, it has to be a bigger animal. Yeah, a horse, I don't think I could take. Maybe to, like to slit the death, its throat. I think I could stay away from it, but I think to the no, death. No, you can't stay away from it. I can go run faster than a horse. I can go around it enough where it'll be like. <laughs> no, dude. You're, You're just gonna turn it into a pretzel. It? <laughs> <laughs> what are these amazing athletic abilities? You yeah. It's not that amazing. I think you guys are gonna <laughs> outrun a horse. You're giving it. I'm not outrunning it. I'm outsmarting it. If you can't, out- <laughs> <laughs> if you can't outsmart a horse, just say it, dude. I can't. <laughs> I don't know, man. <laughs> <laughs> That's all I'm saying. He's- you guys, I think we had to do one of those challenges that Daniel and, and, and George, George did. Yes. Like, oh, I want to see you running against a horse. Yeah, like no. a horse. I still think it's we should do the three running. on three. What's the three on three? What do you guys want to do? The three of us versus a Tim horse, George, a mountain and lion, Velasquez, <laughs> and what? And a drunk high, everything spelling bee. Oh, dude, I would win. Decathlon. Yeah, I'm a good speller, dude. Uh, spell coincidence. No. Spell coincidence. <laughs> <laughs> no. I'm not a Spelka fan, dude. I'm not, your, I'm not your fucking I'm puppet, dude. Yeah. I'm not your puppet, dude. Yeah. I'm spell for free. Yeah. I got medals for this shit. You think I just about yeah. You got medals? Yeah. You're no, spelling dude. Uh, I'm not that good of a fucking spelling. Uh, <laughs> yeah. I'm not that good of a spelling, dude. There was always one Asian kid in my school. <laughs> that I wasn't going to beat. Would no, you? I was always out in the first round, dude. I, su- I sucked at spelling back then. I think I'm better now. What'd you tell me to spell? So. What'd you tell me to spell? Coincidence. C O I N C I D E N C E. I lost. That sounded right. You're watching it. Aren't you watching it? You have the words. Was that you? right? You're wrong. Ah, oh, oh, fuck. That's. I knew it. Though. I knew it. What is it? <laughs> no. like, Tell me that. Would you rather live in a world without headphones or a world without doors? Headphones. <laughs> Yeah, headphones. I'd play music out loud. I'm I not need gonna... some fucking privacy. Yeah, people can't boy. see me jack off. They can let me hear my music. <laughs> I yeah. need some privacy. Hey, there's corners. You have corners. <laughs> nah. Oh, fuck that. I hear people play their shit all day anyway. It doesn't matter to me. <laughs> nah, man. I'd rather have headphones. Really? Then yeah. a door? Then doors, yeah. But you know what? I'm thinking house? silent jerking. Okay, what about imagine the front door of your house open at all times. Pat yeah. doesn't want to be alone. What? Yeah. People are going to come in. Oh, they don't have to. But they, but will. they will. The world's just not going to be a better place because there's no doors. <laughs> That's fact, that would be, be a, a more lawless place. If nobody, if there's no rough. doors in the world, why would they come into mine? <laughs> I think it's, it's going to get a little rough. Nah, man. It has to. I, I, I'm not living in apartments. I live on the fourth floor. There's so many more doors before they get to my spot. I don't know. I'll still need to <laughs> So you're hoping that... Yeah. They're just going to get tired. I'll put, I'll put up a curtain. You would like let people... I put up a curtain on. like some booby traps. Like if that was the you case, I'll wait till I hear people fucking, and then I'll walk in at that point. I do enjoy porn, <laughs> porn with headphones. I mean, do you yeah. enjoy porn with doors? <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I mean, yeah. What would you rather do without porn or, or without headphones? Yeah, you rather frame it up. I'd rather oh, have the door. Yeah. Nah, no. I could, I'd rather have headphones. I, Cause like what? Like you can't listen to music. You can't listen. Like sometimes I want to listen to stuff that I want people to know that I'm listening to. <laughs> Miley Cyrus. Have you ever heard my? I'd rather have yeah. them know well, that. When, do you, when do you use headphones? Every day. But like, I the use same. headphones when, do you I really? like, when I exercise. Me too. I use headphones every day too. I strictly use At headphones work. like when I exercise. So like, when do you use headphones? All the time. When I walk the dog, when I walk anywhere, when I. Uh, really? At work, I use headphones yeah. when I'm doing my work. I just fucking. I use, I use, I boots, I use boots with headphones. <clears throat> yeah, those are headphones. Whatever in the warehouse. Yeah, boots with headphones, yeah. That's those cool. are headphones. No, but like. Other than that, when you're working, no, yeah, that's and that's for like two or three hours, maybe yeah, an hour. When I work fucking an hour, that's lit. No, no, in the warehouse. Oh, when you're doing shit. Oh, yeah, you're a driver, dude. You're whipping the fucking truck. Yeah. I remember the first time I met this guy, we hotboxed his fucking 
delivery truck. His I want to say what company. Band. I want to say what company. <laughs> oh, you can't go. I don't work. There. I don't remember what company it was. It, it was, was like FedEx. FedEx. Yeah, I think it was FedEx. There. And oh, it was the FedEx man. I think it was FedEx, yeah. And he was just like, yes, I spoke. And he just fucking opened his big ass fucking door. Right. Yeah, I was thinking the bitches would be everywhere. The only time I've ever smoked in a van is with this guy, yeah. That no, was not don't even Don't put me out there like that, you know what I'm saying? <laughs> <laughs> You know, that's his move. I don't want that to be, <laughs> yeah. I don't want that to be the word. Not like, that's where hey, kids, you want to go to my van? Yeah, you guys like weed? That's Dude, how got us. We yeah. smoked a fuck ton of that. Okay, hold on. You guys didn't answer the question. Wait, there were days where I would go to work and they're like, Scott, you need to stop doing this. Yeah. They're desperate, bro. I don't think there's any animal that I could take out. I like. I want. I want somebody Patty, that you can take out a dog. dog. Understands, the, but I don't want to take out a dog. I love dogs. It's just if you yeah, but the dog's trying to kill you. Cat. No, I'll take I'll a take cat. Out. The, the fiercest animal. Yeah. You know uh, what I mean? Uh, like a mountain lion is fierce. Thank you. Fierce. Beyonce. <laughs> so is Beyonce. I mean, like you know, I'm thinking like a goat or something. Yeah, I can take Beyonce. <laughs> a goat's not fierce. <laughs> a goat. Choke her out the same way. I don't nah, know, man. A goat's dumb. A goat's not fierce. <laughs> I, I Bro, but if it's like attacking, it's different. Is that a goat? But not any. I guess, is any animal fierce when it attacks then? I I could wrestle a, a, a bear cub <laughs> if like there's no mom. Cute? There's no mom around. Like there's no like, like a koala. No, one on one, you can fuck up a koala. I'm, I, but they're not fierce. I, I won't wait, Patty. I won't wait. Equal weight. <laughs> oh, no, 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 you're no, totally no, bugging. No, no, 236 no, no. is a 236 bear. <laughs> <laughs> he, no. he, has, he has to be waiter. I ain't yeah. fucking with him, dude. No. <laughs> and he has to go first. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, dude, yeah, I don't think I don't know about that one. Kind of. I mean, like, do you? No, you know what? I believe you, Pat. You, make, I, <laughs> you don't think I could take a, a bear that's uh, 238, 236? Yeah. <laughs> and wait? Yeah. Patty. Yeah, I come think on, so. my boy. I think you can. Don't yeah. make me be the one to say it. I think it's got to tackle him. Two thirty-eight is kind of small for a bear, though. I think that's like it's a little cub, dude. Nah, you can choke cub. out a cub. Yeah, I choke the neck. shit out of a cub. You can snap a neck of a cub pretty easily. Dog, probably. he's got no mom, so he's like, "Yo, what's good in the street?" Because that's that's, that's <laughs> bro. He came up hard. That's what you're worried about. No, I'm not. I'm saying they don't have a mom. I'm just saying mom's like, yeah. Oh, you can't said abandoned. Mom, can't really get sad. to me. No, you we're said, it got bambied. We're in a cage. Nick's the uh, cub. George is the bear. Like you know what I mean? It's it's two thirty six. That's a small cub. Now that I think about it. Thank you. Dog. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. So they Pat's know. gonna be able to be like, hey, stupid. <laughs> what the fuck are you doing? Yeah. Yeah. Around, dude. Fuck. One on one. Yeah, show him yeah. what's what, dude. Where's this bear from? Is he from Kazakhstan? Does he like fucking roll no. with fucking uh Is it like a UFC b- fighters? Hey, no foreigners. I didn't sign foreigners. Is it a BGD? <laughs> yeah. I want an American weapons. bear. Yeah. <laughs> There's no weapons allowed, dude. Yeah. Come on. Yeah. I'm not trying to get stabbed. Yeah, dude. It's American bear, 236. Let's go. Oh, Find me a bear. <laughs> <laughs> Dog, do you realize how crazy that would be? All right, what's your answer then, Scott? Come on. Give us something, dude. All right. Have some faith in yourself. No, I'm, I'm good. I can't. <laughs> I mean, they're not going to come out. <laughs> yeah. Like, I don't want to talk ill. They're not going to watch this yeah, guy. <laughs> yeah, I don't want to talk ill on mountain lions. Yeah. No. I want them to know I was loyal. Mountain lions is crazy. When I see the next one, yeah, I want to Mountain lions is great. Like, if I see how, like, big, how, how, how big is a mountain lion? What does a mountain lion weigh? Average size one. mountain lion. You can get like a 150. Active, bro. Active in the streets. Yeah, I've seen a video of Just one. Just like dude. bumping. 150. And how, much, how much you weigh? Like 180. 180? Dog, that's so wild. That's what I'm supposed to weigh. I'm supposed to be like 180, 175. Never happening. <laughs> yeah. I got that 200. I was like, that's it, dude? I was like, fuck this. <laughs> yeah, yeah. I'm all right on that. So generally, uh, though, males weigh between 115 to 220 pounds. Oh, yeah, I can take that. Females weigh between 64 and 140. Oh, dude. Get, throw me a female fucking You can't take a female. I'll take, I'll man, take two, oh, man. I'll take two. I'll take two females. Nah, man. And a but, man. But look at that for for context. The stretch. Oh, yeah. The stretch of it. Yeah, yeah I can take they that. Dog, that looks there. wild. I can take exactly. that. Exactly. That, that looks a mountain so lion. wild. Yeah, no, he would die. That, a mountain lion? No I way. can take that, dude. No, dude. Yes. You Bro, I'm trying fucked. to think, like, what could I, like, just straight up kill? <laughs> and I'm thinking of their god. So like a rabbit all day, like a peacock. Oh yeah, that's out. That's out. I, I can get an ostrich. 
No, when ostrich go fuck yourself. Yeah, ostrich going like thirty miles. No, per hour, ostrich bro. would yeah, fuck you up. Yeah, I'd up though with the hands. No, ostrich so? would fuck That's you up. That's an easy up, neck to snap though. Don't hit me. Don't don't hit me with like. Right, just it is a yeah frail neck. But yeah, they're like dude, eight feet. They're like ten feet them. fucking tall. Like when you chop someone nah. and can't fucking breathe. Breakfast, <laughs> Breakfast Club. <laughs> No, dude. Ostr- appetite. Ostrich. Ostrich. Fuck yeah. Poke the shit out of you. How nice, big is an bro. ostrich get? Watch. Over here telling me about 120 pounds. You're talking about like a ostrich. Ostriches are ostrich. fucking tall, bro. Seven foot ostriches. That's, That's what I'm saying, bro. I just hit it with the Goldberg. Yeah. Nah, you, you don't got, you don't got the reach, bro. The Goldberg? Yeah, spear. You feel me? Hey. Jack Hammer, real quick. You can't spear an ostrich, dog. <laughs> dog, yeah, you can't. The legs. Or oh, the neck. The neck. Go for the neck. An adult ostrich weighs between 250 and 300 and can measure up to nine feet tall. Oh, you're not bring me your best. Uh, you don't got the wingspan. Bring me your Ray best. Be a great you don't, you don't got the wingspan, <laughs> bring dog. Bring me your best. You're not hey, fucking that I told up. you to believe yourself. So I dog you walk. I, I'll fuck up a kangaroo. I'm with it, dude. Fuck kangaroos. Oh, I'll piece up a kangaroo. Oh, yeah. Kangaroos Maybe. would be a good battle. Especially if we go fisties. That'd be a good scrap. Like, that would be a good, up. yeah. Short arms. Who do you think you can beat then, They're Jake? solid. Your negative I'll go with can- yeah, kangaroo. Maybe. A fierce kangaroo? Who's ever said that sentence ever before? That jack? Do you ever see that yeah, jacked kangaroo? kangaroo yeah. On the memes? Oh, yeah. But fierce? I don't know. Ostrich. Plus, they got like mad diseases, bro. He's playing the long game, dude. Yeah. yeah. Getting it's like fucking malaria pills. Pre- yeah, yeah, for real. Yeah. He's yeah. like, I'll wait. <laughs> yeah. 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 See you in two months, dude. Or, or would you rather fight 100 duck sized horses? Or horse sized Or dog. one or one horse sized duck? <laughs> Horses, I'm kicking the shit out of like their little dogs. So you would rather fight 100 duck-sized horses? Yeah. A hundred, that's a fucking lot. A hundred. You're doing a lot of punting. I'm already tired. So what are you going to put on? Like, what's going to be... I'm just going to start jumping. You have headphones in this scenario. Yeah, dude. (laughs) What's going to be in your headphones? (laughs) (laughs) But everybody's going to hear you do it. (laughs) Yeah, dude. One horse-sized duck is scary as fuck, dude. Yeah, because they bite, too. They're pretty... They're snappers. Try to sell me insurance and shit. No, get out of here. Yeah. I'm going with the horses, dude. Dude, give me a... Yo, give me the kangaroo first, and I'll take whatever. How I many have. horse kicks from Come little on. horses does it take? <laughs> yeah, to get 100 equals out? one, dude. Kill shot. No. What are you starting out like in the, that Oklahoma stance? Yeah, <laughs> Oklahoma drill. If the only way you could take down an animal is to jerk him off, which one would you do? <laughs> <laughs> Horse is easy. Mountain lion still? Yeah, mountain lion, yeah. A female mountain lion, dude. I'll, yeah, I'll find her clit, dude. <laughs> I'll fucking jam out. <laughs> still mountain lion. Yeah. Come on, bitch. Squirt. <laughs> <laughs> Oh yeah. shit! That's great. Great question. Yeah. So great stupid. question. Next. Yes. That's so <laughs> Would you bang your cousin to win the Powerball? Jesus Christ. How much is the Powerball? How, how, <laughs> how direct of a cousin and can I pick a male cousin? <laughs> I'd rather do something gay with my cousin Matt than gay with my girl cousins. <laughs> is that the one that looks like the rock? It would just be less weird, huh? Is that the one that looks like the, the young rock? Who looks like young rock? Young no, rock. that's my cousin Dominic. The one that Jackie wants to... Oh no, that's my brother. <laughs> no, that's you're my talking brother. about you're talking about uh, he's talking about Bubba. Oh, Bubba! No, that's just a homie, dude. That's the drug dealer homie. <laughs> Jake got a little. So he's free game. From high school, yeah. <laughs> from high school, little... bro. That's a dog. We got a fatal attraction. Oh, dude. Yeah, I don't know about that one. How much is the lottery? Which is a good question. And uh, how close of a cousin can be like a second cousin? You would be good for life. Nah, I mean, that's not how good is life? <laughs> yeah, for real. Well, Let me ask you a question. <laughs> Just give us a number. Give us a number, dude. Uh, fifty million. Duh. After taxes? <laughs> oh, twenty five is gonna make a difference. Yes, dude. <laughs> What's that headline read, dude? Like, <laughs> yeah. What well, happens first? Winner yeah. wins twice. Yeah. You don't want to know what this guy did to yeah. win the lotto. Do I get the big check press conference before or after I fuck her? It was a fun family <laughs> reunion. Uh, I don't know, dude. That's a tough one. Did you see that thing like the man with the thousand babies? No. Nah, I mean, I, was, I saw uh, the preview for it. What's that? You saw some dude just jerked off a bunch. Had a thousand babies? He, he's doing some wild numbers. Like... He was donating his sperm? Yeah. Oh, but, yeah. Was like, but it was like, he was doing shit like Genghis Khan, bro. But he was doing like off the mark, like off the grid, yeah. right? 
He was like, doing wild shit. He was shit. doing the Craigslist and, like, and the stuff. The crazy thing is, is they were like, uh, like you can fall in love with that person faster, and it's because of the how like the genetics work. What do you mean you can fall in love with them? Quickly? You would fall in love with them faster, not knowing that you're related to them. Yeah, that's why because I, you're half the same person. Yeah, uh, by law they have to limit. Like, they limit them like what? how many you could distribute to. Yeah, he yeah, said still, for that but, rate. But that they thing. don't enforce. They don't enforce anything. But they're at least eighteen years younger. What do you mean? No, but how he's old doing, was he donating sperm for? Like he did like over the man, a man with a thousand kids. Like there yeah, was a, there was a situation stages. where like uh, these kids with the same daycare. And they found out that they were related. They're like, hey, they look alike. It's like, oh. oh, same guy. Whoa. Yeah. Yeah, they were, like, they were doing wild shit. That's crazy. That's hella illegal. Is it? Yeah, you can't yeah. use He's your... the same person? No, you but can't. how does he know? Because if you just donate once, it's like they could use... No, it he, was, he was with the he banks. He was donating. Oh, like, he was like going he was, direct. Yeah, he was selling direct. times you could do it. Was he a good-looking guy, at least? No, he uh-huh. just had long blonde hair. No, so people wanted genetics. That's what I'm saying. Like, were a lot of people like yeah. fucking dying for this guy's. And genetics? a lot of people were f- like thugs. It would fugs them. I mean, oh, a face only a mother could love. Oh. Oh, they were fugly. They, I mean, they. That's they were crazy a dog. That they all came to him. I'd shave their ass and teach them how to walk backwards. That's a sand lot. <laughs> that's a sand lot. Insult. That's great. But some of these, some of these women, like, were so desperate. Like, uh, oh, that's a bad what, part. One of them got yeah. like, because uh, you got to keep it cold. You got to keep it, you know, iced up or whatever. I've seen Austin. And that, so she was, she was stuck in traffic for so long that she just pulled over and inserted the no. the yeah. semen Whoa, on the side of the road, dude. So she imagine, did, imagine like, on and soaked it up. Yeah, no, like you get like a turkey baster and like oh. shoot shoot up the club or whatever. <laughs> shoot up the club. And, uh, but imagine like I don't know. Yeah, gotta... that's crazy. Yeah, man. But they, like it was him and another dude were involved. Like this is a spoiler. Yeah. All right. So like him and another dude, they'd be like, "Yo, like this chick wants uh, my sperm." I'm like, yeah, we'll spin the wheel. Like they make they were making games out of it. Whoa. So some of them don't even know which one there was. Yeah. That's wild. That's so irresponsible. Bro, it was some old, like, I mean, it's some wild shit. That is insane. How much did they get paid for this? That was oh, the thing. They weird. weren't getting paid that much. They did it for the love of the game? Yes. Wow. They did it on cheap, cheap. Because if you go, like, well, I mean, they were doing private. And then, yeah. no. Well, but remember, really I said they, you, remember, I told you they were dogs? I told you they were do- dogs. He would still knock them down. Oh, he would bang them straight up. Some of them, yeah. Whoa. A majority of them. He said, a majority of them. Dog. We're proud of that I mean, fact. Bro, <laughs> yeah. but they, were, they were dogs. Yeah. Hey, if you're getting money for it. No? He's not, I think he was getting like 1900 There's hardly probably any woman I would say no to if they're offering to give me money. 1900 <laughs> Right? Yeah. How many women are you saying no to? Me? I'm married, bro. I don't know what are you trying to do. Oh, yeah. You in trouble? For I money. know there's a lot of people you won't say no to, but uh. yeah. <laughs> for money though, <laughs> for nineteen hundred dollars. Yes, are you kidding me? Yeah, man. I we can go. <laughs> no, I'm not, I'm not paying anybody. He'll, he'll fuck you for nineteen hundred dollars right no, now. No, I'm not paying anybody money. They pay, if they're paying me nineteen hundred dollars to fuck me. You're just a loose goose. Yes. Yeah. Uh, I you would, because you would, I know that's never gonna happen. And two, it's like if somebody walked up to me. Oh, so he's game. logical. That's why. <laughs> well, yes. But if, if you were, were playing the hypothetical game, bro. <laughs> no, dude. This is. If, if you were in a relationship or you were married, you wouldn't do that for nineteen hundred. No, I wouldn't. <laughs> I wouldn't. They would understand. <laughs> like we're going on a trip. Nineteen <laughs> hundred. Shut up, bitch. Yeah, you can go on a quick trick, dude. A weekend. Let's go fucking. <laughs> Are you gonna take a corpus? Huh? Nineteen hundred, dude. Oh, yeah. I get shit on the. On the what cheap, a size, cheap. bitch. Yeah. <laughs> I get stuff on the cheap, cheap. So it's a little less. Nah, uh, Nineteen hundred get me a weekend in fucking San Francisco, easy, bro. So like nah, you're a gigolo. Give me, give me ten thousand, and then I'll think about it. What? Yeah. Trip. what kind Patty. of dick do y'all think y'all are giving? That y'all are worth more. He's That's saying, my question. He's saying to cheat on his wife. He's not saying to fuck abroad. But no, he's. But I'm saying if <laughs> to you're put single, my, my if you're single, 
Yeah. Oh, if I'm single, yeah, that's different. But, but that's I'm not. what I'm saying. I know. I'm saying if you're, you're making I'm it so seem married, outrageous. I can't even fathom yeah, the you idea. Know what, you know, yeah, I aspire to be a great husband like you. Like, yeah, yeah, I really do. So. I can't even hypothetical it. Yeah. <laughs> that's love. I right mean, there. for me, probably like 80 bucks. <laughs> <laughs> honestly. Yeah. Honestly. What's They're offering me money. Yeah. I find okay. 30. Yeah, okay, yeah. How many days is it till my payday, dude? Like, yeah, exactly. <laughs> right. I don't get paid till next week. Right, I'm yeah. yeah, you know grinding up eighth and some cones. Yeah, yeah. whatever. Yeah. yeah, you got an eighth? How late am I on my <laughs> phone bill, dude? Like, yeah, exactly. <laughs> just parking this shit. Dude, exactly. Jake, well, no, Jake's more high class gigolo, yeah. I would say. <laughs> my going rate's up there. Yeah, Jake seems like a going rate because he'll turn down Jake, pussy. Uh, he's he's going to take a meal. <laughs> he's going to take a meal. <laughs> nah, Jake will do it for. 20 G's. No. Jake would do it. He ain't got Jake class. needs the money. He ain't got class. Why are we acting like Jake's fucking rich over Bro, here? Bro, realistically, I, I give him 500. Bro, He'll none's, go. none's got people more sex than money. Wait. Everybody's got a price, bro. I, I mean, I feel you. Yeah, that's what I'm, I'm saying. I'm saying Jake's is way lower than what you just said. <laughs> Oh, he's less than 20. I'm saying lower. lower. I thought you were saying higher than 20,000. No, not no. even close. He's, he's like 500 top and bottom, bro. <laughs> bro. Happy, happy, yeah, dude. Okay. This guy will take a double stuffing. You want the bisexual experience? You gotta get From fucking yeah. Magic Johnson. Bring your own dildo, though. He doesn't, provide, he doesn't provide dildos. Yeah, dude. That's gross, Jake. You're right. I forgot. I forgot you're one of those. He'll take <laughs> a double stuff from like for 20 grand. He's getting stuff with magic. How low? Okay, how low would you go then? Give us your lowest number. Like sixty you're, bucks. You're a gigolo, and like, no, you're what's you. your lowest going rate? You gotta know your. You're word. you right now. Dude or gal? Gal. <laughs> both. No, gal. Wow. Oh, oh yeah, you know what? Give us both. Let's do both. Let's do both. Dude's gonna be up there. Dude's gonna be up there. Dude's gonna be up there. Yeah, dude'll be up there. Obviously. Yeah. My baby knows his worth. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. It why obviously? I don't know why obviously. Mean, obviously? I don't know. Fuck a dude. Because, yo, they're willing to pay more. <laughs> yeah, they, yeah, they got the money. I guess so, yeah. Guys are hornier than girls. Okay, so what well, would you charge a girl then? Uh, What are we talking here? Like, attractive girl? Yeah. Doesn't matter. Doesn't matter. Uh, Four. <laughs> yeah, a four. Oh, four. Oh, oh, a four. That's a good me? number. Four for money is, come on, that's easy. Uh, that's so fucking... Head in New York. <laughs> she got a cute face. Who knows? Get two fifty. Uh, that's fair. That's not bad. Two fifty. I mean, you're bugging a little bit, but that's a know. little much. But yeah, you're you're she, providing. I see a hundred dollar bill, bill and dick, she's I'm like, saying. "Yo, I got the night." A hundred, okay. <laughs> oh, now you're bargaining. You just talk me down. Yeah. If he's had a couple drinks, <laughs> yeah. 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 Cool, yeah. You know, what, give me a hundred. We'll call it a day. <laughs> Yo, get his gay rate a grand. Oh yeah, it's up there. A grand is my, up there am for I you? topping or am I bottoming? Bottoming. You're just, oh, no, yeah, it's up there. Yeah. How much? You're just Jorge Posada. It's got a I have a feeling you're It's a fucking there. dealer's choice, bro. <laughs> 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 They'll tell you. Yeah, for real, yeah. They're yeah. paying you, buddy. They're going to pay for the surgery. Um, 50 Shades know. of Grey Holes. I think your <laughs> high is not as high as you think it is. Thou Wow. I no, think I Thou Wow. Look, let me speak for my. Let me That's speak for it. my. <laughs> you guys do a podcast with this guy? Can I take a dick for a thousand dollars? He's done it for less. Yeah, bro. I'm gonna get you. <laughs> you think shame? I'll do it. I'm for shaming him. Is worth. I'm not even shaming him, but my brother's more than a thousand, thousand dollars just to say that he fucked Jake in the butt. <laughs> get the I will grand. put the money down. Get the I will grand. put the money down for that. <laughs> I would. Me and George will go half on that. For my brother to fuck you in the ass. Let's set it up. <laughs> All right. We'll my make it baby happen. Guys, this is legit. This it. is on podcast. I'll do it for Whataburger coupons. <laughs> we, we can get you $1,000 in Whataburger coupons. <laughs> if you need. All right. We want $1,000. 500 500 <laughs> yeah. Give me till next week. I got $1,000 for you. You got to give me till next week. Give me till next week. I got to fuck some fours. <laughs> 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 yeah, Daniel's going to get me a handicap box. Prices up. Prices up. Where were you? Buy now. Buy now. Prices up. Prices up. up. Prices up. Prices up. Prices up. Prices up. Prices up. I will pay that money. Hurry up and buy. Just, <laughs> just to say that it happened. All right. So hold on. Set it up. I will. <laughs> I mean, <laughs> you should give him definitely like an option. But I'm classy. I need him to be tested and I need condoms. Yeah, obviously. 
Yeah. Well, that's coming out of your money. <laughs> <laughs> that's coming out of a thousand, dude. No way. That's coming dude, out of your money. Dude, my 20% dude. is secure. There's free testing. <laughs> <laughs> I hate how much you know that, dude. God, dude. <laughs> how many free you know credit chips have you made, like... dude? <laughs> what? Nah, you nah. had the clap, Jake? This guy doesn't have to let us tell us. Not anymore. Well, you know, that's a story for another day. <laughs> oh, dude, you look like you should get tested. <laughs> no. I'm clean, dog. I know. Uh, he's in a relationship now, man. His girlfriend. You're in a relationship, yeah, his... no, Scott? No, I'm not. I'm not. Scott is in love? I'm not. He his is. girlfriend uh, Our Scott forbade Ramos. him from using Facebook. That's why Scott's not on Facebook Our anymore. little Scott yeah. Ramos is in love? He's cuffed off he's, the streets? He's changed. I have to pee. <laughs> like, like, he's wow. not allowed. I've never thought until today he'll get chained. He's on a chain. I'm like no. No. Yeah, 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 yeah. Everyone's relaxed. Yeah, that's crazy, bro. Let's, let's I never thought it'd be you, Scott. Let's everyone take a step uh, back. Where are we at? Where are we at on time? We can wrap this up. Can you see that timer? Uh, it says one ten. Oh shit! Oh, what was Jesus going on? Christ. Uh, man. All right. Uh, what do you got going on? What do you got to uh, promote? Um, Black Rabbit. Hell yeah. In Austin. Hell yeah. Uh, doing a show to East Austin Comedy Club. Hell I don't yeah. Know this is coming out. <laughs> uh, probably Thursday. Oh, yeah. The next week. Hell, yeah. Next Thursday. I forgot the day. Fuck yeah, dude. Uh, but yeah, dude. Nick does comedy. We're going to get our podcast going again, hopefully soon. We're trying to get on video. We're not very photogenic. What's the podcast name? Uh, Rosales Radio. Rosales Radio. That show was And we're trying to get Hello bro. There back up with Jakey and Danny Bones, too. Yeah, man. Yeah, Daniel. Yeah, our Hello There episodes are fun. I like those podcasts. So, yeah, dude. Look me up. Follow. Uh, fellas, you got anything to promote? Uh, the second I think I'm doing that hop doctor again on uh, Hebner, I'll have the address later. Also, yeah, yeah, the hop doctor on Hebner Road. Uh, I'll be there August second with Scotty, shenanigans, uh, Jakey Five underscore on Instagram, uh, the station comedy club every Friday night. Uh, yeah, at Blind J- Tiger, <laughs> Blind Tiger. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> uh, at Dream Week Pat on uh, IG, Uh This Thursday, I will be headlining the Pico de Gallo uh, restaurant for the Comedy Con Comida. Uh, yeah. so that should be fun uh, Friday. And then uh, I think that's it. Everything else, BobCoolCore.com and uh, IHomiePat.com. Like and subscribe on YouTube, all the good stuff. Uh, we'll see you next time. Peace. Peace.